The talk is all about Washington cutting both the men's and women's swimming and diving teams. On Friday, the school issued a statement claiming budget cuts were the reason behind the cuts. And readers have been pretty vocal about this news on our website since we posted it Friday morning. Here's a, uh, here's a comment from a woman who goes by USA Swim Mom. It's a sad day when a major university drops an entire swim program. Swimmers usually do well academically and actually graduate. The ASU men's program was reinstated thanks to contributions and vigorous fundraising efforts, mainly by team parents. Hopefully, this program can be reinstated in a similar fashion. Well, let's find out if those efforts are already underway. On the phone right now is Whitney Height, the head coach at Washington. Coach, welcome to the show. Thank you. Well, uh, tell us, is this, um, is this reversible, or does this seem like it's, uh, it's not coming back? Well, I don't think you, you never say never, um, but it certainly doesn't look good. Um, I, you know, I don't know what the, the alumni are, are doing. I'm, I'm meeting with them later on this week and um, try to point them in the right direction, but, uh, you know, it, it does not look like uh, um, it, this has happened a couple times before to this uh, program in the history, and just think, you know, maybe the third time might be the charm, and, and it, Washington may be no more as far as swimming. So, how did you and the team find out? Describe what that was like. Well, I this had been uh, I got the word earlier in the week, um, and actually flew back from. I was on vacation at the time, and came back and ended up uh, meeting with the AD on Thursday, Scott Woodward, and um, he told me, and um, Friday morning told the team, and, you know, I, I think that, you know, there, there's no easy way, no right way to um, give a group of 30, 20-year-olds uh, news that, uh, that their program is being cut, but um, certainly it was, it was a brief meeting, and then um, he uh, he came in, said his piece, and, and left, and we've been uh, picking up the pieces and um, ever since. So, so but, uh, then it falls on you and the other coaches to to kind of support these kids because you know while right. we do feel for you, coach, I mean you got to really feel for these kids, and this is their this is their lives. Right, without a doubt, and I think that that's the. That's a little bit of the dangerous thing. I, I think that you're dealing with um, you're dealing with people's hopes and and dreams, and I think that that's very. When you take that away from people, or or you mess around with that, that that's dangerous. Um, and, and certainly, that I think that that's the most disappointing part. Um, I, I'm extremely disappointed, um, but uh, I, I think that you know you. you my, my job now is to um, get the kids in good places, and, and there's been a, there's you know a, tr a tremendous amount of support, as you said. I mean, I, I my mailbox has been full, both email and voicemail, and you know I, I appreciate you know everyone sending uh, kind words. You know, I wish uh, I wish it were a different situation, but um, certainly you know I appreciate you know my colleagues supporting me and. Um, you know, my goal is to get the kids in a in a good place because they all they're all good um, good kids and great students and you know we we prided ourselves at Washington of um, being a team of, of of people that work hard and uh, so that's what that's what we are. So. I can uh, I can I can hear the pain in your voice, Whitney, and uh, I mean I. You know, it comes at such a terrible time in in the respect that you've really got this program going in a good direction right now. There's got to be some frustration on your end there because, I mean, you guys had awesome swims at NCAA's and seem to get better every year. Yeah, well, well, you know, I, I appreciate that. Um, you know, it, it is hard. It'll be hard to see the kids, uh, um, you know, go. And, and, and I think that, you know, we... You can blame it on the economy. You can blame it on this and that. You know, our our football team was mentioned in 
in the explanation and you know it's at the end of the day it's a philosophical decision um, that you either want swimming or you don't and uh, just like everything else I, I tell all the recruits that I've ever recruited you know whatever decision you make will be the right one because you make it right and we could have figured this out um, you know I mean yeah times are tough and and this, that, and the other, but but at the end of the day, it's uh, to to have the near sight that you know. There's no foresight, you know, as far as this is a decision that stands over time, and and you know, I, I just think that there's not a lot of uh, you know vision, um, future vision, and, and which is too bad because it does affect a lot of people, and you know, and. It's, uh, it is what it is at this point. And like I said, I mean, my, my goal is to, to find good places. And, you know, it's not about – I'm hoping that the alumni and, and, and people in the Northwest will, will make their thoughts heard. And, um, but this isn't about just Whitney Height. This is about Washington swimming. Um, you know, we were able to come in and, and work hard and, and have success. And um, it'll hurt to, to see – um, if I land somewhere, it'll it'll hurt to um, to see the the kids uh, probably uh, swim fast and beat my team. But I know that I that I wish them all the best, and I'll do everything I can to um, to make a really crappy situation right. Well, coach, if there's anything we can do at the morning swim show here at Swimming World to uh, to help the kids, to help you guys out there in Washington, just let us know. But uh, thank you for coming on the show. And uh, we hope uh, things turn around here rather quickly. All right. Thanks, Peter. I appreciate it. All right. Thanks, Coach. That's uh, very somber. Whitney Hyde joining us from the University of Washington. Let's take a quick break. When we come back, we'll talk to Auburn's Brett Hawk.